What's going on, Legion? Azrael here, like always. And we got some 21 Pilot stuff. Um, I actually, no joke, <laughs> I just forgot the name of the song. Uh, this is, uh, I'm not even going to pronounce that. Oh, cr come on. Levitate or Levitate? Oh my God, am I a bot? Am I a bot? Am I just that dyslexic that I just didn't read that right? I almost, I'm like that close to just restarting the video and pronouncing this right instead of being an idiot. But you know what? We're not, I'm dyslexic. I can't help it. Uh, I just, I read stuff wrong. And with that, I mean, the continuations. I, I, I looked at the first couple seconds to see what they were doing. It's, it's still blurry, still in the middle of the woods. The story continues. Um, and yeah, man, I, I'm, I'm actually excited to see if this, what this song is about. I actually have a, my prediction is I'm not going to like the song that very much. Like it feels like it's going to be a, I heard the beginning like two seconds and it starts out very like low, not like hype at all. So I'm thinking if the whole song is like that, I'm just not going to be about it. With that also, Nico and the Niner, I'm still listening to that. I'm still listening to it almost every day. That's a great fucking song. I'm down for that song. It's in my playlist. I listen to it when I stream on Twitch. All this stuff. Um, so with that, let's just get into it. Check it out. See what it's all about. Oh, God. Please, please let this be good. Even if I don't like this, I know the 21 Pilot fan base is always very nice. I literally was like, I don't like car radio. I hate it. And someone's like, well, you know what? That's the best thing about 21 Pilots. There's something in there for you. And I'm like, you're the nicest person ever. I love you. In a strictly straight heterosexual kind of way but I'm glad you're here and so the community has always been like that super nice and super incredible and that's why I love that's why I still do 21 pilot reactions by the way is because the community is just incredible and uh yeah let's go let's get into it again check it out I hope, I hope it's good please God let it be good so this is all I've heard right here just this and I'm like Ugh, I don't know yet <laughs> okay okay Since the seventh grade, I learned to fire breathing. Though I feed on things that fell, you can learn to levitate with just a little help. Learn to levitate with just a little help. Calm down, calm down. <laughs> Cowards only come through when the hours late and everyone's asleep. Mind you, now show up, show up. I know I shouldn't say this, but a curse from you is all that I would need right now. Man. Calm down, calm down. Cowards only come through when the hours late and everyone's asleep. Mind you, now show up, show up. I know I shouldn't say this, but a curse from you is all that I would need right now. Man. Danger in the fabric of this thing I made I probably shouldn't show you but it's way too late My heart is with you hiding but my mind's not made Now they know it like we both been for some time I'd say The smirk in Afro's blood, the circle in above But this is not enough, yeah this is not what you thought No no we are not just graffiti on a passing train I got back what I once bought back in that slide I won't need to replace this culture is a puncture of overexposure Not today don't feed me to the vultures I am a vulture who feeds on pain Sleep in the wallet room, don't let the shadow through And sever all I knew I can depend on my weekends on the freezing ground that I'm sleeping on. Please keep me from please keep me down from the ledges. Better tested wooden wedges under doorways. Keep your wooden wedges under doors. Cause I'm gonna watch everything. Now here comes the end. Wait, habits here too. You're the worst. Your structure compensates with compensation. Feels a lot like rising up to dominate by track. To at least they all know all they hear comes from a place. Oh, I know how to levitate up off my feet. And ever since the seventh grade, I learned to fire breathing. Though I feed on things that fell, you can learn to levitate with just a little help. Levitate with just a little help. <laughs> uh, this, um, this part, I, I hear that. Oh, uh, it was blurry, right? Levitate. All right. Well, huh. So as the typical fashion goes, now that I kind of rate some things, um, I'd give that a seven out of ten. Song, video combined, I'd give it a seven. So 
if I was driving or something like that, this is a song that would be playing. I would not put this in a playlist. There is nothing about the song that actually grabbed me. Funny enough, I just did a fourth impact, which would be the Filipino sister group, and I I was I just did a video for that uh, for that song or for them doing a cover of Ariana Grande, and so if you want to check that out, go check that out. But I asked that community, which is probably the other biggest community besides the Twenty One Pilot community, and I said, hey, why don't you guys come over and check out Twenty One Pilot and see what that's all about? Um, that'd be really cool. Um, you know, and so it's funny that I asked them to come out on this song because this is not a song that I really care about at all, honestly. This is just, it's good, it's not bad or anything like that, but it's just one of those times where I'm just, I'm not a fan of it. Um, I listen to it occasionally, I'd have it in something if I was like, say, driving or whatever, but like if I'm streaming or whatever, this is not really a song that would get me hype. Now, I don't know what it is about, but Nico and the Niner, uh, but that song is just so damn good. And for me, I've always noticed that about 21 Pilots, there's a one song that I just kind of latch onto that's just insane, that I'm just so about. And then the next song is just not my thing. Um, it, Cause it doesn't bring it kind of hype. Now in this grand scheme of an album, if I was listening to the album in full and it went Nico, this and the next song, I would probably go, I like this song. But the fact that we're just listening to this alone um, is just kind of, eh, you know, I, the music didn't, I think what it was is the music is something that I really latch on to of being really good for, for top. Um, the music is some of my favorite parts about anything they've done. Um, like the vocals are always incredible and there's some vocals, whether it's heathens, but heathens is like uh, the good example of of vocals and music just being so on point for me personally is why I gave it the very rare 10 out of 10 at that time because it was I was just so hyped for that song. Now maybe I it would be a lower rating, but you can't go back for what it was then. It was just insane. Um, but like Nico had good vocals and good. Uh, music. That's why I got it was like a nine and a half. Um, but this one, the music wasn't something that super grabbed me. I think. Now, for anybody that's been here a while, you probably maybe noticed that we haven't been doing a lot of those deep dives that I usually do for Twenty One Pilots, which is looking up the lyrics, reading over some of the lyrics that stood out to me, reading them out. And kind of going, this is what I view it. These, this song, this music is just so new that with, with the other music, it's been like three years. They finally did an interview. They kind of just gave up all the secret about that song. And now you as the fans know what it is. I don't follow 21 Pilot like that. I don't follow their interviews like that. Um, like the storylines that may connect some of their other songs. That's just, that's super fan stuff. And although I'm a fan, I just don't, dedicate the time like that to, to follow them and I don't really do that with any musician it's just it's not them I I'm whether it's doing YouTube stuff live streaming or my personal time where I'm watching eight different shows whether it's live action anime or something else I don't have really the, the time or the desire to follow a band you know like that so I always rely on the comments to really give me the information that I do want to know uh, but I just don't want to like take the time myself, you know. Like I'm look as far as looking up stuff. Like I'm looking at Marvel and DC databases on all the lore that goes on in all those worlds. There's a lot of stuff. There's hundreds of worlds, and everybody has their own thing. So that's a lot of information over there. But Star Wars is in my life. It's Star Wars. Star Wars is coming back. The Clone Wars. So that takes up a lot of stuff that I want to look up and get into. Bands is just not the thing right now. And so, especially with this, the interviews, I don't know if they're even out. I don't know if they're doing interviews about this, whether it's actual face video interviews or just, you know, writing down, you know, that kind of thing. And this is what Tyler said. And, you know, going into it like that, he said, you know, we're all continuing. This is like one big story. And the cool thing about this community is there's so many of you that you can literally just pour in my comment section all the information you know, I can read it all 
and I get an overall picture. So much more information than if I went out and read three or four articles. So that's kind of one of the things that I'm not doing as far as this new music is I'm not really doing a lot of deep dives. I'm kind of just checking out the music, checking out the song, and we're kind of just doing it there. Now, if they do what they did last time with the whole mute math thing or something like that, mammoth mute as we used to call it, um, if they do something like that, we may revisit some of these songs. If there's other versions of these songs in the months coming, you always can link those. And um, I'll check those out again, and maybe we'll go into some more deep dives in that direction. But as of right now, I'm not doing a whole lot of the deep stuff right now that we do some, with some of their other um, songs. It's just not what it is. Now, as far as, like I said, the song goes, I, I, like, I liked it. <clears throat> I give it props, respect the talent and all that. It just wasn't something that gripped me. Something that didn't grip me like, like, uh, like I was like, oh my God, I got to listen to this again and again and again. I give it an eight or a seven, I should say, excuse me, seven, seven and a half. I don't, uh, seven. Uh, because I, I like the flow. I like the style of what he was, what he was doing. It, honestly, it was just the music. The music didn't really just, it didn't really latch on to me. Like Tyler and everything he did. I was like, yeah, okay, I can feel it. I can, I'm bobbing my head. It's, it's, I'm liking it, but it was, I don't know, something about the music just wasn't really my, wasn't really getting me. Um, and I think that's where I'll end that right there. If you guys want to go check out the Fourth Impact, check out something uh, a little different from maybe what you're used to. Uh, go check out the uh, the Fourth Impact stuff. Uh, it's a cover of Ariana Grande. It may not be the best version or the best song for you guys to go check out if you never heard of, of these sisters before. But they've done a lot of other stuff. So if you search my reactions, you'll just see, or excuse me, if you go to my videos and go to my playlists, they're in the music playlist. And uh, it's just, they've, they've done some really incredible songs. Or just Google them outright and try to find some awesome, awesome song by them. Great people. If you do check out the 4th Impact song, you know, maybe in the comments, put up a top fan. Hashtag top fan here and I'll know that you came over from this video and you're checking out something over there it may be the most views I have in one day possibly because these are the two biggest communities I'm uploading the videos at the same time although it is later in the day this isn't like early like 1 or 2 p.m. we're already at 4 5 ish right now 4 30 and so by the time I'm done with everything it might be 5 the day is going to be pretty much gone so I'm interested interested to see what the response from the communities are to see if there's any overlap and to see if you guys maybe check out something different. That's kind of the point. And with that, I'm going to get out of here. So thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. I like to be like the content. You can always like, subscribe, or share. Remember, it's completely up to you. I do appreciate it, though. It does help me out in some way or another. And if you want to check out anything else I'm doing, oh, hell, I'm doing fucking Slender Man. That's coming out probably tomorrow. We've got some Slender Man stuff. We've got some Red Dead Redemption stuff. we got some nut Nutcracker stuff. Uh, we got some good, good good reactions coming out. So if you want to check out any of the other craziness that's coming out, check that out coming out tomorrow, the day after, whatnot. Videos every day. And with that, I'm done. Thanks for watching again. Thanks for hanging out. Once again, my name is Azrael. And I'll see you on whatever I'm doing next. Later.